Hi everyone. In this episode, we'll discuss about the adenoviral keratoconjunctivitis with sub-epithelium infiltrates. Adenoviral keratoconjunctivitis are the most common self-limiting and recurrent conjunctivitis. Adenoviral keratoconjunctivitis with sub-epithelial infiltrates can be found in 50% of cases at chronic phase but after the acute phase is over. Symptoms include watering, photophobia, foreign body sensation, decreased visual acuity. Signs that are seen are sub-epithelium infiltrates in cornea may also consist like eyelid edema, conjunctival congestion, conjunctival chemosis, follicular reaction, pseudomembrane. Goals of management include reducing the conjunctival inflammation, restoring the patient's comfort, minimizing the spread of infections, and preserving the visual function. Treatment for the acute phase includes cold compress, lubricants 8 to 10 times daily, topical antibiotics 3 to 4 times daily to treat or prevent the bacterial infections, and topical antihistamine and vasoconstrictor to reduce discomfort. The use of topical steroids in acute phases are controversial but they are mainly reserved for the chronic phase with sub-epithelial infiltrates involving the visual axis and with visual impairment. Steroids are used to avoid the scar because scar reduces the visual acuity after the recovery. But long-term use of steroid can induce glaucoma, so low-potential steroid like lotopretinol 0.5% is used, but with very slow tapering process, and followed with the tacrolimus to avoid the recurrence of the infections. Thank you everyone.